Something I think is kind of sad about this whole thing is that it's showing that a lot of people don't really want real news. You don't want real journalism. You want a bunch of tabloids. Some of the same people who will claim that, well, you know, the media is trying to cover up Muslim terrorism because they won't declare immediately that someone is a Muslim and that, that their religion is the uh, primary reason why they committed this act. They're, they're, it's, it, they're trying to cover up Muslim terrorism. Are the same people who, after Baring's channel got uh, taken down, are saying, it must be the SJWs. They have to be at fault. And our freedom of speech is being eroded. My freedom of speech, my freedom of speech, my freedom of speech. When you don't know a damn thing about why it happened. You don't know a damn thing, but we, we have to jump to these conclusions. People like Undoomed, people like V, let's jump to these conclusions. Well, it, it you know, V with the, the oh, some, some sort of e, new EU rules or something like that. People, oh, it must be globalism. You know, a lot of the comments trying to shove, oh, globalism. <laughs> this is this is our free our first amendment rights going out the window. And that one I always thought was funny. People claiming that their first amendment rights are being violated because a website uh, kicks them off. It's like um that has not a damn thing to do with your first amendment rights. First amendment rights, you know, it, it has to do with, you know, the government can't jail you or fine you for making a statement. Only types of things that you can't do is, uh, you know, like uh, physically threaten uh, uh, people, uh, physically th uh, threaten the president, uh, talk about assassination, or for something like yelling fire in a crowded theater, right? You know, those are the only types of things that you can't really do. Otherwise, um, you've got freedom of speech. But yeah, people seem to be wanting tabloid-style news. We can't trust mainstream media because they're not declaring that any any act of violence that, that happens is, is from Muslims. Muslims. Islam. 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 Man, I'll never forget this back and forth I had with uh, uh, Prince of Queens. <laughs> he made this statement that 100% uh, of of terrorism that's happened over the past year in the United States has been from Muslims. Sam, so really? Really? Let, let, let me look that up. And I, I can't remember exactly what the percentage was, but there are a whole bunch of incidents that happened that had nothing to do with Muslims. So I quoted that, and he goes, well, you know, what's the source? I gave the source. Well, you know, that's not valid. What's your source? Well, I don't have a source. It's from my own personal experiences. Really? What personal experiences have you had with this? Well, it's, 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 I, I saw some things in the news about, about a terrorist act, and, uh, and then uh, they never said anything about their, their religion, and then it was shut up. Oh, so that's proof that 100% of terrorism that's happened over the past year well, well, I don't really mean 100%. I, I mean, yeah, sh shut the fuck up. Okay, you lost that argument. And this is the type of shit that people will say. That, that, argument, that, that, that argument just was pissing me off. Fucking ignorance. Yes, let's let's report on something before we have the facts. And unless someone comes to the same conclusion as I do, it must be it must be uh, uh, corrupt news. It must not. They're not really journalists. They're not, no. We need facts. We need enough facts before we can make a declaration about something. Okay, here's the thing. 
If something is conjecture, you say it's conjecture. If something is just your opinion, you say it's your opinion. If you don't know something, you say you don't know something, but hey, you know, I, I, I have a feeling it's like this, right? Fine, that's all fine and dandy. But when you go around suggesting that your personal conclusions or your opinions on this is fact, like Prince of Queens did with this 100% of, of terrorism in the United States over the past year was committed by Muslims. And then you can't even get, there aren't even any sources for the shit. Yeah, I, I mean, I, I imagine what was actually done in, the, in that, that argument is, well, he had sources originally, but I already called out saying, well, uh, the religion of peace.com is not a valid place to get that information. The religion of peace.com is a website completely dedicated to being uh, to being against Islam. It is an anti-Islam website. Okay? It's about as uh, it's about as valid of a site as uh, everyday feminism. Okay? It's just it's it's a propaganda site. I could find about eight different propaganda sites that would try to give those sorts of statistics. But let's not look any further into it because, well, you know, uh, 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 and, and looking any further into it means that you're, you're giving mainstream media a chance. And we can't do that. Only alt-right media matters. Yeah, fuck that shit. Okay, I'll look up, I'll look at a right, uh, a, an alt-right source or a right-wing source for a moment, look at what their, their biases are, try to look at the facts that they give, and then I'll cross-reference those facts with other places and see if they're actually giving out actual facts. There are too many people who are part of the whole alt-right thing that do not... Alt-right, right, right whatever the fuck you want to call it, because you want to make sure people can't use that label, so they can't talk about this, so they can't, um, they can't state anything against what you're saying. Just like a lot of the, the SJWs and some of the fourth wave feminists like to change language, so you can't talk about those subjects either. Same sort of shit. Let's change the language, so you can't talk about it. Let's make it so you can't even put the label alt-right on something so you can't talk about it. Hate that shit. Do we need to say things more on an individual level? Sure. But what do you do when there is a whole movement? Okay, if I don't get to say alt-right when I'm referring to this larger thing, if I don't get to say alt-right, then you don't get to say feminism. And you don't get to say SJWs. Okay? If I don't get to use my labels, you don't get to use your labels. And if you want your to be the right to use your labels, then I get to use mine. That's just kind of how it goes. So, yeah, people seem to want tabloid news. You want right-tilting tabloid news, otherwise it's not a real news source. Well, guess what? That's not how journalism works. <laughs>